eyes. My eyes are looking like little tiny spiders. Anyway. We be working all day long. We push us funny. Funny. We ain't playing no games. How about coffee? Gunny. Yeah, yeah. We light up the party. Gunny. Everyone, welcome back to my channel if you're a returning subscriber and if you're new here welcome to my channel my name is Marilyn so today I have a first impression review and demo on this eyeshadow palette over here and this is the beauty glaze glitz glam eyeshadow palette in the number b13 I did the unboxing of this eyeshadow palette on the um, shop hash dose of colors eBay textbook center haul I put the card over here to link you guys to that haul. And when I did the unboxing the box kind of fell apart so that's why it's looking all tattered and stuff but this is what the box looks like and then at the back you just have the name of the eyeshadow palette the ingredients the instructions and then when you open the box at the top you just have the name some palm trees and on the back you have the same information as you have on the box and the palette has a magnetic clasp it is such a beautiful palette. The shadows don't have any names, but that's okay. And then over here, this thing, it's texturized. So you get five eyeshadow matte shades and five pressed glitter shades. I bought this palette off of eBay and it was $4.99, so basically $5. I think the shipping took around a month. Yeah, I guess with that being said, let's get into this makeup look. So... So this is the finished look. I feel like it. I went super duper chola. I wasn't intending on being so chola with like my little spider eyes. I, I don't know. We had ideas and we went for the ideas. I wish I did like the white line. I feel like that would have gone better with this eye look. But anyway, now we can get into the review of this eyeshadow palette and I can give you my thoughts. And as usual, I categorize my thoughts into pros and cons and we will start with the cons. So. As always I have my little notebook first con is it does have quite a bit of kickback and I feel like that's normal when it comes to most eyeshadow palettes. I've yet to come across an eyeshadow palette that doesn't have kickback one day I will experience an eyeshadow palette that doesn't have kickback if I could show you when you swirl your brush this one has significantly more kickback than most eyeshadow palettes but the kickback is only on the matte shadows not on the glitters the another thing i want to mention is there is quite a significant amount of fallout with this shadow so i would suggest that you first start with doing your eyes before you get into your face the glitters do have quite a bit of fallout if you use your fingers there would be less fallout i'm not sure i didn't try using my fingers i didn't use my fingers because of my nails they're just so long <laughs> there was no way i was gonna like and then the thing that i did not like about this palette and that is based off on the ingredients list is that this palette does contain parabens so if that is cause for concern for you you might want to keep away from this palette another con of this palette which isn't really a big con for me but might be for you is this brown shade here isn't as pigmented as the other shades it's decently pigmented yes it's just not as pigmented as the other shades the other shades are so vibrant they jump at you put it on your eyes and you're just like whoa the same does not apply to this brown to the pros of this palette biggest pro this palette is so pigmented 
oh my god <laughs> especially with the glitters i was super blown away after the whole video i said that this was going to be the first glitter palette i would have ever used but weeks later i received this in the mail it's from the same company beauty glazed and i used this palette to do like one of my makeup looks and I, the glitters did not stick on the brush whatsoever so what i had to do is i had to use my finger to put the glitters on my eyes but i was so surprised when it came to this palette when i I dip my brush and I put it on my eye and there was so much product I was like wow 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 you don't have to get so messy with using your fingers and packing it on your lid like thing I'm impressed by is once the glitters get on your eyes they stay there when I was packing the glitter on my lid that's when I did get a bit of fallout but once I put them on the things that I put on my lid are still on my lid I would still probably wear glitter glue but I can honestly say you don't need to another thing I love is that this palette is very very inexpensive for five dollars you get 10 shades five press glitters and five highly highly pigmented matcha does for each shade you're paying 0.5 cents another thing that i would say is a pro about this eyeshadow palette is at the back here it says it's cruelty free so that means like no animals were harmed in the making of this eyeshadow palette that's okay so that brings us to the end of this first impression review and demo of this glitz glam <laughs> of this glitz glam eyeshadow palette if you're interested in purchasing this palette i will leave a link down in the description box so you can check that out and another thing you can also check out is my first impression of the other beauty glitz palette i did so if you did like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already also don't forget to click on that little tiny notification bell that's somewhere i don't know if it's here or here i never know i never know up until i upload the video i'm like it's there so i'm so sorry oh i'm going to find out where this little bell is one of those finders but it is somewhere down here a little tiny notification bell that way you can be notified anytime i upload a video thanks for watching and see you all in my next time first time i have them all like i feel like such a vampire they like look so scary first impression review and eye tutorial <laughs> so today i have um i almost said foundation so today i have a uh, why do you want to say foundation yeah 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 it's the palette the eyeshadow palette <laughs> I am a pansy, passy, I keep saying